Okay, so I'll share the screen and we'll get started. Can you see, bro? Uh, it's coming up. Uh, yeah, I can see now. Okay, so give me address what you want to evaluate. Uh, for the so I'll send it on uh, WhatsApp. Okay, so in order to get started, you know, uh, remember whenever you open the Google Maps like this, okay, the upper portion of the screen is represents north, right portion represents east, below represents south, and left represents west. Very true. Okay. Okay. So this will always be the case whenever you open the Google Maps. When you are opening on the phone, you can always tilt the direction, but in the desktop, there is no, I mean, I mean, they, they don't have facility for tilting the direction. So it will always be, when you are opening on a computer, it will always be, up will be north, down will be south, right will be east, left will be west. Okay. Okay. Brother. Okay. Okay. So... Give me the address. I, I ping you on WhatsApp. Okay. Okay. So let me take this. Okay. So now see this address. Do you see uh, all the homes in this area? How they are aligned, alignment to the screen. You see how they are aligned. They, they are like tilted. Uh, not yeah, They are tilted. So none of these homes you want to go for Vastu. When you, as soon as you see, just mm -hmm. reject it. You don't okay. have to even look at such homes. Okay. okay. They are all tilted, okay? None of them is aligned. None of them is facing the four directions, east, west, north, south, okay? Now, out of these homes, I can say here, if you go, uh, for example, this home, you see, this one exactly, seems to be somewhat aligned. Right, yes. Right? But none of the other homes, you see, everything is still. So you don't want to even look at such homes. Now, uh, I'll say, for example, okay, I'll say, okay, I'll take my home address. Okay. So now you see all these homes are properly aligned to the four directions. Right. Okay. And you can always go to the satellite view. That will give you exactly the, uh, you know, view of the home as well, you know, from top view. You see? All right. Yeah. So here you see uh, this home especially. Uh, this has little bit extension in the northeast, so this southeast appears to be cut a little bit cut. Yeah. Okay. So this is considered northeast extension. This kind of home is very good. Yeah. Okay. Make sense? Uh, yes. Yeah. So northeast extension is. Uh, is yeah. Okay. Now you see this home four five seven three for example. This has little extension in the southeast. Northeast is cut. Okay. This is very bad. You don't want to even look at such a home. Okay. But again, this home, you see, this has northeast extension. Okay. So this is good. Okay. Then we can look up the floor plan of this home. Okay. If this is criteria is met, then you can actually look into the floor plan. Otherwise, don't even look at the home. Okay. okay. Similarly, uh, you know, now see this homes, for, for example, this home is west facing. Now these homes are east facing, right? These homes are west facing, right? This way, yeah. they are west facing. So mostly west facing and south facing homes, you don't want to consider at all. It's not that they are not good, but you will not be able to find a good home facing west and south. Okay. okay, the home can be facing south or west, you know, but uh, it is it is not considered uh, 
mostly you will not be able to find such a good home you know south or west facing so you will stick only to east and north so prabhu out of east and north the uh, east is better or north is better both are good okay. both are good east is preferable north is also good so don't uh, don't worry about north and east now i want to show you these are see north facing homes right yeah the home is facing towards north i want to show you something here in contrast now you see this home particularly okay uh this is 1816 okay golden willow this home you see this has northeast extension do you see this yes sir yeah southeast little missing this is not really northeast extension but this is southeast cut okay okay this home you see on other side 1818 this has also little bit extension in the north east but this is northeast extension now can you tell me what are the difference between the two so uh, i think uh, more than 50% of the first yes, one is exactly uh, exactly yeah. so see in in the case of this home the extension is less than 50% now if we take the whole north side wall the extension is less than 50% but here in this case the extension is more than 50% so this doesn't become extension but this becomes a southeast cut okay okay so again you don't want to look at this such a home so what happens is you know you can fix if you can fix you know if you can make extension here and make it straight then it will be good but mostly it's very difficult to alter anything in the front side of the door municipal will not give permission hoa will not give permission even if there's no hoa but even municipal the local you know municipal office will not give you permission for that okay so generally you don't want to even uh, waste your time and energy in such home and again alteration in the front of the home is going to be very costly right it okay okay so you generally want to avoid uh, such a thing okay. now just remember uh, a home which is south or west facing like i'll show you for example this 4509 okay 45 no not 4509 i will say which one here 4514 for this okay. example okay so this has southwest entrance in the garage right yeah. this home if somebody gives you free of cost you shouldn't even buy, take the home even free of cost you should not buy such a home okay okay because southwest entry is going to bring all kinds of uh, calamities and difficulties for owners of the home okay, okay. Because mostly people use garage right for their entrance to their home right you don't want to have such a home but true, this particular thing is like uh, facing completely west right yeah so this is facing come... west so you know you don't want to even have such a but uh, one question is like how it became uh, southwest and something something that you said right it is southwest okay southwest entry is you see uh, you can divide the home into four quadrant okay like if i divide line here put a draw line here straight and then okay. put another line here so this becomes southwest quadrant this becomes northeast quadrant this becomes northwest this becomes southwest quadrant right. okay. so the, the entry is in the southwest quadrant of the home right it okay okay so either this way or this way southwest entry total non you don't want to even go to such a home okay okay prabhu okay so these are some of the basics so always stick to the homes which are uh, you know either uh, north facing or east facing okay so here you see this home 4509 you know this is almost like 50% so this is still good you can consider this home because this is northeast extension okay this will be considered southeast extension you see this is southeast extended wait okay and this will be again southeast extended this will be considered northeast cut because you see more than 50% is extended here in the southeast so this will be northeast cut so these are some of the terminologies whenever i communicate with you you will know that okay this is what when i'm saying northeast cut means what and when i'm saying southeast extension means what right. because practically speaking you can say this is also northeast cut you can say this is also northeast cut but no 
uh, in Vasu terminology, this will be considered southeast extension, and this will be considered northeast cut. Okay. Okay. Okay, bro. Okay, yeah. So, so this one... is basic. So once you meet some criteria like this, you know, like this kind of home, then you want to look into the floor plan. Then you want to even ask the person, give me some floor plan. Then I want to look at that. But if it's not matching, you don't even call or forget, you know, you don't even want to even look at that form. Okay. Okay, bro. Yeah. Any questions, bro? Uh, yeah, bro I think uh, I got the basics, so, but I had to go and look at some things and then, yeah, we'll be able to uh, understand basic of it. So, yeah, bro, I'll go back and uh, uh, see a few homes and see if I'm able to figure out. Sure, bro. Yeah, I'll reach out to you in case uh, if I have any question. And sure. sorry again for troubling you on. Uh, no, 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 no trouble at all. Thank you.